To begin navigating the WildSpotter app on your iPhone device, you'll first need to go to the Apple Store, search for WildSpotter, tap the download icon, and hit open when it is done installing. The first time you open the WildSpotter app, there will be introductory informational slides that you'll swipe through. You'll then select the wild place that you're going to be visiting, which will download the invasive species information and list for that location. You can change your location at any time or as you travel. After the customized information for that selected wild place is downloaded, the home screen will appear. The home screen provides the user easy access to the species list by selecting species ID, the reporting form by tapping report, a map of your current location if you are connected to a wireless data plan or Wi-Fi by selecting location, as well as information about that wild place under the about feature. You can also find this information by selecting the three horizontal lines on the upper left side of the screen, which will bring up your dashboard. Other options within the dashboard that we haven't already talked about include settings, where you can sign in or create a WildSpotter account and download offline maps. You can return to the home page, the queue where your reports are saved until you upload them for verification, and wild places where you can change your wild place. With this information, enjoy exploring the WildSpotter app. And while outdoors, keep an eye out for invasive species.